All right, in this demonstration, I just want to demonstrate the bridge tool. Um, when you use the bridge tool, you're going to have two pieces of geometry to which you want to connect. So I have this piece of geometry here and this. And what I want to do is I want to bridge these two parts. So I want to put a, a connecting piece in between. Now, what I have to do first is combine these two pieces of geometry. So I'm going to hold down Shift and connect or select both of them. And I'm going to go up to my mesh and say Combine. This is going to treat these two as one uh, individual. Now I need to go down to my... I'm going to be using the Bridge tool uh, and in my Modeling Toolkit. This is how I do it. I'm going to hit my right, right click and go to Edge. I'm going to choose... I'm going to double click on this edge here and this edge here. And it's important that your edges are the exact same count. So this has eight edges and this has eight edges. Now I'm going to go down to my modeling toolkit and I'm going to select the bridge button. Now the bridge button gives me some options here. It gives me the ability to change divisions. So if I select this and I hit my middle mouse and drag back and forth, I can add more divisions in this space. So if I needed to add more geometry there, if I just want to have one nice connector, if I wanted to taper it, I could taper it and it should uh, give me some kind of taper or a twist. Notice what happens when you mm, when you twist it. Now I'm going to go to my channel box, my options here, I'm going to go back to my object mode, go down and go to my bridge tools here Let's see if I can I change my bridge offset, notice it will give this a little bit of a twist. My taper attribute's not working too good, so. So I could twist it if I wanted to, but in my in this particular case, I just wanted to bridge right straight across. And so that gives me the ability to combine then multiple pieces of geometry. So then if I wanted to say control duplicate this one to move this piece of geometry down. And it gives you nice the ability to then combine and really in a nice way these two pieces of geometry need to be need to be combined. And combine them again, mesh, combine. I'm going to grab these two edges quickly grab these edges here, double click, double click, grab these two edges, and go to my modeling toolkit. Open that up, go down to bridge, and now I have that nice piece of geometry there bridged. And I can combine those very well if I go to my if I give myself a nice proxy, I can see those are combined quite nicely. So that's a really quick, nice way to combine some objects. All right, that's the bridge tool in the modeling toolkit. You can also find the bridge tool up here under mesh tools under the bridge tool. Great.